So hi everyone, my name is William de Geer. I'm the new CEO at uh, Besedo. So before I joined Besedo, I was working as the COO for Pingdom, um, software as a service company focusing on website monitoring. I was based in uh, Stockholm, Sweden. And uh, before that, I have been working for Meltwater, which is also software as a service. I was based in London and I was focusing on the DACH region. I was responsible for that meaning Germany, Austria, and Switzerland. I have also got a background in media. I used to work for Media Planet, a Swedish uh, publishing house uh, that also focus on online media. And uh, I was based in uh, various locations. I was based in London, I was based in Bratislava, in Slovakia, and also in Stockholm. Apart from that, I'm also a bit of an entrepreneur. I founded my own company back in 2013. Uh, basically, it's an Airbnb, but for dog services. So basically, dog homeboarding, dog sitting, and daycare. Uh, the company actually got acquired uh, two years ago, so that was uh, fun, of course. Uh, and uh, apart from work, uh, I like to go kite surfing, skiing, hunting. I like to travel. I like to spend a lot of time with my family. And that's pretty much it. <laughs> so the fact that Becero makes the internet better and more safe and secure for its users is very encouraging. I think what Becero does is very important, it's relevant, it's valuable, and it's scalable, meaning I think there's a lot of people out there that need our products and services. So I think we have a great opportunity to build a fantastic company. And I definitely want to be part of that journey. So basically, uh, COVID-19 has, of course, had an impact uh, on Becero, but I think that we handle it really well internally. So. Um, First of all, we took it very seriously from day one. So we started to work proactive. And the first goal was obviously to make sure that our employees were safe and that they could work from home. And the second goal was to make sure that we could deliver a good service. And I think thanks to ICT, country managers, AMs, team leaders and agents, the transition went very smoothly. Um, so I'm very happy to say that I think we did a good work. I've also heard that from a lot of clients. And also on an interesting note, we did a survey in Bogota and also one in Malta. And the outcome of those surveys were very positive, meaning that people actually enjoyed to work from home. Having said that, not everything was perfect, of course. Uh, we have had some hurdles here and there, uh, as in technical difficulties, uh, outages and so on. So obviously we need to continue to invest in our infrastructure uh, to make it even better. And uh, moving forward, we are going, going to do that. So we have uh, short term, some interesting initiatives that we're gonna roll out. And uh, long term, we're also gonna look at uh, desktop as a service, as a solution that I think you know our organization could really benefit from. So that's also in the pipeline. So I uh, joined in uh, February and obviously I got off to a bit of a rough start with uh, COVID-19, but I was lucky enough to be able to travel uh, to some of our offices uh, before COVID-19 forced countries into a hard lockdown. So I was able to meet our employees in person and uh, I have to be very honest here and say that I'm very impressed. I think we have a lot of hardworking, ambitious people at Becedo and also they're very much fun to work with. Moving forward, there are a lot that we need to address. As always, there's always room for improvement. Uh, but to mention a few projects that I will focus on in H2. Uh, so first of all, we have uh, the onboarding experience for new customers at Pesedo. I want to improve that, uh, make it more efficient and more user friendly, basically. Uh, second of all, we want to continue to invest money into our product team and our AI to make sure we enhance the product, uh, but also so we can release features faster. And then uh, thirdly, we wanna look at our service delivery, of course. I think we have done a lot of good work in uh, H1, but there are still things that we can address. There are tweaks here and there that we can do. 
uh, to make sure that the service becomes even better. So that will also be a focus area in H2. And then last but not least, I would like to travel a lot and um, fingers crossed and hopefully have the opportunity to meet uh, most of our clients in person. That would be great. I really look forward to it.